What's up, everybody? Neil the one four sixteen back with another video. Kind of going outside the box here, and um, I was able to find one box of uh, MetaZoo. This is the second edition MetaZoo uh, Cryptid Nation. I tried to look up online what some of the major cards to pull out of it. I mean, I know Mothman in the first edition uh, is a big one, and so forth, but uh, I'm not sure in second edition Cryptid Nation what are some what are some big pulls. So. I'm going to open it. It comes with three booster packs per box, ten additional cards per pack, and one exclusive holographic promo. Um, if you guys have opened this before, so again, it's Cryptid Nation 2nd Edition. Um, the only TCG where your surroundings matter. Um, and again, three booster packs per box, ten additional cards per pack. One exclusive, and then on the back, just some information about the game or the TCG. I'm just going to break right into it. Like I said, I'm really going to need the help of uh, you guys. Um, uh, I'm really hoping, or going to ask the help of you guys to see if I hit anything big, let me know. I'll probably sleeve most of them up just because, but uh, yeah, if you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell notification so you can get notified when I upload new videos. And hit the like button if you like the video. Hopefully it can be shared and other people can like it too. Alright, so let's get right into it again. I'm not sure what to expect. Not sure what to even look for, but I got it. Oh, so it's only... Wait, what? So it's three packs. Oh, is there ten cards per pack? Oh, that's what it is. Yeah, okay. Nothing left in here. So it's 10 cards per pack. So it's not three packs plus an additional 10 card pack. Whatever. All right. So let's see what our exclusive is. A Pi Piazza Piza Bird. Uh, he's the one on the front of the box. You can see right there. Okay, then I'm not going to open it. I'll leave it in the paper. Let's see if I can put it in a sleeve. Still in the plastic. Alrighty, so there's the first one. MetaZoo. Contract unless you were like a dragon destroy this page. Huh? All right, looks like it's in pretty good condition. We'll put that in the background Now we got three packs uh, Well, that's Mothman. That's a big one. I don't know what that is. So we'll, we'll open them in that order Let's see what we can find I think these packs uh, the the pack you see there from Walmart's like 12 to 15 dollars Man, these are hard to open. All right, I don't know, like like uh, Pokemon, if there's some sort of, you know, you move a certain amount to the front or whatever, but let's see what we got here. Chaos Poison. Gumaroo. White Thang. Sam's Four-Leaf Clover. Balancing Beam, Miracle Touch, Shock Aura, cool looking cards, alright, an Enfield Monster, Hollow, it's a little bent, we got Ground, and Lightning Aura, alright, so, again, I have no clue if I hit any of those, any of those were good ones. This one's a little bent, though, if you can see it. See the gap underneath? Of course, it's got to be the hollow or reverse hollow, or whatever this is. But again, just fun opening, seeing what you can get out of it, you know. Alrighty, so there's that one. Uh, again, I have no clue if any of these are good, so we'll put them off to the side, and we'll open up the next pack. 
If you guys have opened MetaZoo and you know anything about it, please, please, please let me know. I mean, I don't think this card's worth a lot of money, but he, if it is and I'm not aware of it, I'd appreciate it if somebody would tell me. So it looks like it was like the last, so two forward, because then the last one was the hollow. So we got nighttime. All right, so I see it. Here we go. Frost Aura. And then we got a Enigmatic Field. A Giant Salamander. A Wapalusi. Trip Tripadero. Gluttony. Hide Behind. The Spookster. And... All right, uh, that looks cool. But again, why are these all bent? All right. Tizarek, Tizarek, Tizarek. I mean, I guess that's a regular hollow. Nothing ever stays up there when I put them up. All right. Last pack has got the Mothman on it. So let's see if the Mothman can bring a Mothman. I would enjoy this a little bit more. And it's nobody's fault but mine if I knew more about the cards and what's good to hit. But... We got a farm. Got another lightning. And then we got an alien astronaut. Gigi Bird. Reflection. Skeleton Lanterns. Crossroads with Mothman in it. Miracle Touch. Stone skin and a bunny man. All these hollow cards are bent. I mean, look at this. Why are they all bent? Oh well. All right, guys. So I mean, sorry. It may seem like a little lackluster for me. It's just like I said, I'm not a hundred percent sure. But uh, if you guys could comment and let me know if anything I hit is of any good. We'll go through it again. You see the Bunny Man, the Pisa Bird, the Enfield Monster, the Tezzerak. And then here's just like, I guess, some base ones. Miracle Touch, Crossroads, Skeleton, Reflection. And if you know if any of these are worth anything, let me know. But I appreciate you guys watching. Um... I'm going to put these back in the box and just hold on to them and kind of see. But again, let me know if you uh, see anything good. Like and subscribe. Hit the bell notification. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.